boys and girls. I'm so glad that you've joined us for some fun in the kitchen. And you know what? I have some special helpers today. I have Miss Summer. Hi. And Miss Rachel. Hi. And Mr. Daniel. Hi. And I have Mr. Carter. Hi. And you know what, boys and girls? Today, we're gonna be making one of Auntie Linda's recipes. And you know what she calls this recipe? What? what? Hungry Man Hash. <laughs> Who's hungry today? Me. Oh, are you hungry? Oh, you're gonna be by the time we get it. We'll work up an appetite cooking. <gasps> what do you think about that? Oh. So, I'm going to turn our electric skillet on. Now, can you tell the boys and girls out there, what does Miss Cinda say when we have an electric skillet in don't the kitchen? Don't touch it. Don't touch it. And why don't we touch it? Because it's going to burn yourself. That's right. And we don't want to burn ourselves, do we, boys and girls? Mm. No. That would hurt. Yeah. Yeah. So, I'm going to start off by um, spraying this with a non-stick cooking spray. And I put some potatoes on both of your sides so you guys can add, you add the onions, Summer, you add the onions, and then um, Rachel and Daniel, you can add the potatoes. Can all you guys them. reach it? How about if I go like this? All Is that easier? Them. Yes, Do we all have of to them. them. Nope, you don't have to measure. And you can use your hand to get that out if you want because we all washed our hands, right? Yeah. That's right. Let me help you. All right, there we go. Because... I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting. All right, I'll move it over for you guys, too. There you go. It's really important to wash our hands, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's right. Can you get it all, Daniel? Good job. Do you like potatoes? Mm, I grow them in my garden. We have a garden. And you grow potatoes? Uh -huh. Wow, I'm gonna come to your house. Cause you know why? Miss Cinda loves, loves, loves potatoes. <laughs> I could eat potatoes for every single meal. What do you think of that? So can you plant more potatoes for me? <laughs> Like in all the do you what color potatoes do you grow? Do you know there's different color potatoes and different kinds we of potatoes? Grow black ones. You grow red ones? Do you know there's yellow potatoes and brown potatoes uh, and do. white potatoes? Also, we grow grow red ones only only potatoes. Up. Oh, and they're sweet potatoes too. Oh, they're sometimes, yummy too. Sometimes we pa Sometimes there's. Sometimes if, if if we're lucky enough, we might get a red potato. Whoa! Who likes sweet potatoes? Me. They're really different than the regular potatoes, aren't they? Yeah. And yeah. They're way sweeter. <laughs> yeah, they That's are. Why they're called sweet potatoes. Do you know what? When what? I was over in Thailand, guess what color potato I had? What? I bet you can't guess. Black Yellow. potatoes. What? Black potatoes. No. What'd you say? Yellow. No. Orange. No. I don't think Green. you're going to guess, but I'll give you a hint. The color's on the table. Mm. Brown. No. But the color's somewhere on the table. Red. No. Look all over. What Green. color haven't you said? Green. No. Black. No. Purple. Can you guess, boys and girls? Blue. Who said purple? Green. Yes, that's it. I had purple potatoes. I had purple potatoes. So I had purple potatoes before. You have? Mm -hmm. Well, that's what I had over in Thailand. Okay, we're going to let our, oh, you know what? Let's put in our salt and our seasoned salt. So, um, Daniel and um, Rachel, you can measure the seasoned salt and you're gonna need a half, each, you guys put a half teaspoon in, you put a half teaspoon in, have, and you put I, a half teaspoon, Summer, of real salt, and 
Carter, you put a half teaspoon of salt. This is, I don't have a half a teaspoon. Oh, let's find a half a teaspoon. Here, oh, we have four teaspoons. Well, you know what, put in two of these. So you put in two of those. Two of these? Yes, are yours a fourth too? Okay, then put, put in two of these. Do you want me to move this closer? Can you read? Good job. I'll stir and you guys just kind of put, dump it in. Go ahead. There you go. Good job. Two no, of them? Yes, you'll want two of them. You, you'll just want one. Okay. Whoa. I'm throwing potatoes here. Okay, Carter. Did you get one, Daniel? Yep. Okay. I got two. Oh. I got two. Whoa. I got two. <laughs> did you already. lose it in I flight? Got, I, I yeah. Got two in. You did? Oh, you that's were okay. You and then all the people went out. <laughs> it smells good. Does it smell good, Rachel? <gasps> oh, so I'm glad. Good. There I you go. Okay, well, I'm stirring. Can you guys each take hot dogs and be fair so you each get the same amount? And I want you to slice them into small slices, okay? Oh. Don't, no, not, big, not big chunks. And start at the end. So boys and girls, start at one half. end. Tell me how do we do that? Um, we just cut. need to break this one in half. Oh, you know what? Yeah. Miss Cinder will cut it in half. How about that? There we go. There, because we want to be fair. fair, don't we? Okay, you want very good, Daniel. Okay, li little bit, little bit smaller. But think about make when you're thinking about the size to cut your hot dogs. Think about something you would want. How what? How big would you want to take a bite of? Because this we're going to put in here, so you're going to be eating these with your potatoes. So you don't want like big chunks, just want a nice small chunk, okay? This is to look at all my hot and, dogs. And you know what, boys and girls? You know what's special about these hot dogs? What? They're vegan hot dogs. Do you know what that means? They are not meat. That's right. We They're get not vegan, meat. We get vegan hot dogs. We you do? Okay. You can just do them in rounds, Daniel. You don't have to cut them up uh, in pieces. But you can if you want. Who's getting hungrier? Me. Maybe that's why Aunt Linda calls it Hungry Man Hash. Because yeah. while you're waiting for the potatoes to get done and you smell all those good smells, you start getting hungry. What do you think? Me too. You think that's why she calls it that? Yeah. Oh, that might be. It might be. Because I'm getting kind of hungry now. Guess what? What? I made some ahead of time, so just in case, Ooh. you'll still get to taste it, all right? Oh, <laughs> yummy. I was thinking. Did you know that? I was thinking. Pretty smart, huh? Yeah. What do you think? And we're, because it takes a little while for the potatoes to get done. And we don't want a raw potato, do we? No. I mean, I love potatoes, but I have to admit, I don't like them raw. Mm. Have you ever tasted a raw potato? No. no. You haven't? Mm -mm. Oh, well, I wish I'd have known that. I would have let you, oh, here, I'm gonna let you each taste, because this is still, this one's still a little raw. You can, you guys can each taste a raw potato and see what you think. I think I well, there you go. Now you can taste one. See what, tell me what you think. Here, Carter. Mm -hmm. There you go. What do you think? Do you like them better cooked or do you like them like that? They're a little hot, too. Oh, they're too, well, yeah. blow on it. There you go. Is yours, is yours too hot, your potato? You try you it, you feel it. You it open. See? Oh, yeah. See, Daniel? Don't burn your mouth. What do you think? Do you like it better cooked or raw? <laughs> we don't want you to burn your mouth, Daniel. No, I got all mine cut up. If you have all yours cut, you can put them in here. I'm going to take one hot dog. Oh, you may. You guys can eat, your, eat a hot dog if you want. There you go. When you're all done, here, I'll move it closer to you. Okay, don't watch. Right. Be careful. You don't want to touch the pan with your hands. I can feel the hot. Because I think that that would not feel good, mm -mm. would it? Carter, you want me to move I it like close to, to you? I like them cooked. You do? 
don't like raw potatoes. No, mm -hmm. I don't like raw potatoes. Okay, Rachel, you can put yours in when you're done. And then um, we need to let this cook. But you know what? While we're letting this cook, I'll let you taste it. Ooh, How about that? Good. Carter, you want to um, look over there? And I think there's forks over there. Um, on the yep, on the sideboard, there's cor there's forks. How you doing, Rachel? Yeah. Okay, you want to put yours in? Good job. Oh, Summer, thank you for helping. You guys are a team. That's Look awesome. Look what I got. I got orange and orange. You got orange and orange. I got lots of orange today. All right. Thank you, Carter. And I got a green fork. <laughs> okay, we're going to let that cook. And look, I'm going to let you guys taste it. Ooh, that looks good. Mm, what do you think? Looks okay, good. we'll give some to you. There you go. And some to you, Rachel. There mm. you go. And good. some to Daniel. Are you a hungry man now? <laughs> mm. I'm starving. Oh, you're a real hungry man. Mm. There you go. Okay. Oh, that's our kitchen timer. We're almost out of time. But that's okay. We are getting to taste what we're, what our dish is, aren't we? What do you guys think? Mm -hmm. it's good. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Oh, so now you know why she's calling it Hungry Man? Because you worked up an appetite cooking, didn't you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Who likes to be in the kitchen? Mm -hmm. Do you help your moms and dads in the kitchen at home? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. And you know what? Now that you're here, cooking in the kitchen with me, you, when you go home, your moms and dads are gonna go, wow, how did you learn how to measure so good? And how did you learn how to cut your hot dog so good? And you can tell them, well, I was cooking with Miss Cinda, huh? <laughs> you know how I learned to cut my, how? My, my, my hot dog in half? How? My mom, my, my mom cooked Hot dogs she does? Yeah, Whoa. Like I think it's awesome when you when you go in the kitchen and help your moms and dads. That's really important, isn't it, boys and girls? Because that, this is, almost looks like a pepper. It and that's what it's supposed to look like, isn't it pretty? Or a jalapeno. That's yeah. Oh, I love jalapenos. And you know what, boys and girls? It's really important to learn how to cook because when you learn how to cook, then you know how to fix healthy foods. And healthy foods help us to have what? Healthy Mom. bodies. Does, and we want to have healthy bodies, don't we? That's right. That's all the time we have for now. What do you guys think? It's good. Oh, remember, boys and girls, anytime you can be in the kitchen, it's fun.